Good evening and welcome to Gaming with Reg Bob. This is part eight of the free video game collection. So it's been a couple of weeks now since I did my last video and I've had a, a bit of a tidy up. So as you can see, and I don't know if anybody's watched my previous uh, little uh, challenge that I did. I did a, a Wii U uh, collection, a free Wii U collection. So what I've decided to do is combine the free Wii U collection with my free video game collection. So I freed up a bit of space. So as you can see, if I step back, I'm starting to get a nice little collection together. Uh, I think going forward, this is probably the best way combining the two because I carried it, I carried the free video game collection uh, over from the free Wii collection. So uh, just a quick recap of what we've got so far. So I've got the Banjo-Kazooie up on the top shelf there. I've got the Sega Master System, Alex Kid built in there, and I've got the Wii U up there. So as you can see, uh, I've combined the games, so I've got a Master System game there, I've got the DS, the free DS, the N64 game, I picked up the uh, PlayStation 2 games, got three Wii games there, and then I've added all the Wii U games that we got from the last collection I did, and then the two PC games, I've picked up a few few months back now. Uh, I've got the, uh, the Wii U official controller, on there then i've got the game boy games that i've got left and the sega uh game gear game on there so it's looking looking pretty good so far okay you've probably noticed there's a couple of things missing i'll get to those in a sec so this pile here is all the stuff i've got listed on ebay i've actually sold a few bits so there was a couple of uh, xbox 360 connect games so i've sold them uh, made about 50 pence profit on each of those. Uh, I had a spare DS con uh, power supply, so I managed to sell that. got about £6.50 for that. And then this is my uh, trade-in pile here. So I've not had a chance to go to CX for quite a while yet, uh, but this is my trade-in pile. So uh, I picked up this 50 pence uh, for a, another collection that I do. I, I collect Christmas films. Uh, so I was going to trade that in, uh, but it's dropped in, in price. So I think it was about £8 or £9, and now it's dropped to 5 or 6 So what I'm going to do with that is I'm going to take 50p back off what I've spent, and uh, I'm going to keep that now. So that's the, the Blu-ray set there is not included in this anymore. Okay, I've still got the loose disc of uh, Wii Carnival game. Uh, I was trying to sell that but I don't think it's going to sell. It's a pretty cheap game, and the disc is pretty pretty trash. So uh, I haven't got a disc cleaner, and I don't really want to buy one, uh, not for the prices that they are at this moment in time. So at the moment, I've just got that. But the, the darts game, the Wii darts game, is definitely going to get uh, traded in. I've still got the CX vouchers as well, about £13.50, or about £14.00 worth of CX vouchers I've got. Uh, so that's all the power uh, cables and controller for the master system in this tub here. Uh, I've noticed there's a slight issue with the, the pad on the thing, because I've been playing the master system quite a bit actually. So I need to get a replacement part for that. Uh, they're about five pound each, so I'm looking at getting one of that so I can sort that out. Uh, I've still got the Game Boy. I'm looking to get some stands uh, for that. Then I've got the 3DS and the DS Lite, I believe. Yep, because it's got the uh, Game Boy Advanced uh, slot in there. Then obviously I've got one power supply at the moment because the other was a double one. And the two DSs use different power cables, so I need to pick up one of those at one point. Uh, I've still got all the stuff for the Wii U, so I've got the Legos dimension there, and then I've got all the different sets. So if, if you want a full full uh, story on, on this, then I su suggest, or the best option is to, to watch my three Wii U video game collection, but I've still got that, 
which is potential I could sell. I've got all my power cables and TV connectors and everything for the uh, Wii U in there. And I've still got all my uh, Wii U uh, Skylander uh, star packs there. So there's four star packs in there. But yeah, so, so that's what we've got so far. Like I said, uh, as soon as I get some stands for these, uh, they're, they're pretty cheap. They're a couple of quid each and then, then I can display them on the shelf with the rest of the stuff. But yeah, it's coming along really, really well. Uh, I've not really had a chance to do many car boots or pick anything up with the vouchers that I've got left. But I have been charity shop hunting. So currently I've picked up all this. So all this cost uh, £5 in total. So that puts our current spend up to £100. So we're currently £100 in the red. My plan is to potentially sell the 3DS. Uh, I'm not sure yet. There's a couple of scratches on it. There's, there's, there's a slight mark on the screen. But I reckon if I sold the DS with the two games I've got, I'm pretty much going to get £100. So that would put us at zero balance. So then all this will be free so uh what did i pick up for a fiver so all this stuff uh a lot of it was four for a pound or ten for a pound so i've got a playstation game there okay so this is a really nice condition the disc is is really good so uh, i'm going to keep that and i'm going to slot that in the shelf just there uh, I've got quite a few Xbox 360 games, so I've decided I'm not going to collect for the Xbox 360. So I've got that one, I'm going to trade that in. Uh, Saint Row, that's going to get traded in. And I've also got Guitar Hero, going to trade that in. That's going to get traded in. And the Fight Club's going to get traded in. So th there's a about a good £7 worth of trade in there. So yeah, that's that will get my fiver back in in a voucher and i'm also obviously adding games to the collection so so uh yeah playstation game they're getting added in uh i've also uh in the five pound that i spent i picked up some some games so i've got uh two copies of sports party so one of those will get traded in uh the other one i'm going to keep it's in really good condition all the manual and everything's in there so that's great so that will sit nicely on the shelf i'll slot that one in there okay so that's looking nice uh dance on broadway uh this again really good condition so i'm going to keep that that's going to slip in in to the collection there so out of the stuff i've bought that is is what i'm going to keep so yeah that's fill, filling up the shelf quite nicely there uh, this stuff here, uh, the Michael Jackson, uh, it's not the best condition, it's okay, uh, not really interested in it, so, so that's going to get traded in as well, so I'm going to stick that on that shelf there, okay, so as you can see there, the trading pile is, is coming along quite nicely, there's probably, I don't know, uh, eight pounds worth of stuff there to trade in so that would be nice if we can get some something else in replace for the vouchers uh there was a couple of blu-rays in there uh i'll either trade those in or sell those on ebay they're really good condition then i've got a load of uh pc games it was just a case of i i didn't want to just go four for a pound and then just only get two games so i thought i might as well pick up the bits so i've got uh angry bird a couple of angry bird games uh and some disney ones so probably going to look at either trading them in or or selling them on ebay uh with them so that's that and then just random dvds uh these are all going to get either traded in or sold on ebay the dvds are not worth anything much these days uh probably 10p trading on these uh there's gremlins one there which is a bit of a strange thing because the the gremlins collection trades in for 10 pen uh 10 pence but there's gremlins one and gremlins two in there and they trade in for 10 pence each i know it's only 10 pence but it all adds up at the end of the day so i'll probably uh 
trade those in individually and then there's an ugly betty box set there which trades in for about 10 pence so that's probably another two or three pound in in tradings there or or probably two or three quid on on ebay that i'll make so yeah my, my five pounds safe and it's all into the collection so yeah it's coming along coming along nicely and i'm really happy with the progress we're making i know we're still negative uh at the moment it's not actually free but there's there's loads of options i mean i've even, i've mentioned about looking at selling the 3ds there definitely keeping the game boy definitely keeping the ds light uh the lego's dimension stuff i could sell so yeah i've got loads of options there but yeah it not not the greatest pickups in the world and not really added too much other than a couple of Wii games and well, yeah, a couple of Wii games and the PlayStation 3 game, but it all counts and slow and steady wins the race. Anyway, hopefully see you all in the next video. And that's me. Good evening.